Prince Charles has called for urgent and collective action to allow global fish stocks to recover. He was addressing the opening session of the World Fisheries Congress in Edinburgh. Our environment correspondent David Miller was there. Scotland's stormy seas mean life is often tough for our fishermen. But skippers argue the European Common Fisheries Policy is a bigger threat to their livelihoods than the Scottish weather. The challenge is to improve fish stocks while ensuring a viable future for the fishing industry. It's a global problem which will need a global solution. But Prince Charles told the World Fisheries Congress Scotland has proved it's not too late to restore stocks. Well, I am particularly Encouraged to hear the cod stocks in the North Sea have shown signs of recovery from what was only a decade ago a much depleted fishery. By reducing the effort at sea and other management techniques, the stock, I'm told, has doubled over the past six years. And the Prince argued the voices of fishermen themselves must be heard if the challenges facing the industry and the marine environment are to be met. Collecting the data we need to manage those risks could be achieved in part by harnessing the knowledge of the people who actually catch the fish. They are out there on the ocean day after day and they often have a much clearer insight into the state of the marine environment they work in than anyone else. The Prince's intervention comes at a crucial moment for Scotland's fishing industry with the common fisheries policy under review and skippers under pressure. David Miller reporting Scotland, Edinburgh.